عن ابن عمر رضي الله عنهما قال أخذ رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم بمنكبي فقال كن في الدنيا كأنك غريب أو عابر سبيل وكان ابن عمر رضي الله عنهما يقول إذا أمسيت فلا تنتظر الصباح وإذا أصبحت فلا تنتظر المساء وخذ من صحتك لمرضك ومن حياتك لموتك رواه البخاري The Prophet وسلم, he tells us in many different prophetic teachings in many different ahadith about how to view this life in one of them he says be in this life like a stranger as if you are a stranger or a traveler a wayfarer i want us to think about this advice for a moment it's very it seems very simple and short but as is you know the prophet when he tells us something he tells us in a few words something that is so profound what is the mindset of a traveler? Ask yourself, the last time you were traveling, what was your mindset? Think about the hotel room that you were staying in. My question to you is, when you go and you stay at a hotel, when you're traveling, how many of you go into the hotel, look around and say, okay, now I want to start decorating this room. Now I'm going to go to the store and I'm gonna spend all this money so that I can decorate my room. And then we go to the bedspread and we say, oh my, this bedspread, it is the wrong color. And we go and we throw it out and we go and we go to get a new bedspread. No one does this. Why? Why don't we act this way when we're staying at a hotel room? The reason is very simple. The reason is we know that we're only staying there for a short time and then we're leaving. How many of you become really attached to your hotel bed? Like, just don't want to let it go. There's a chair in the room and you just, you just become in love with the chair and you don't want to let it go. Nobody does that. Again, it is just a temporary place and then you're leaving. You don't invest a lot of money in furnishing your hotel room. Correct? You don't become obsessed or attached to the furniture in your hotel room. The reason is that you know that you're leaving. Similarly, if your hotel bed isn't the most comfortable, you know, you, it, it's just not the best bed in the world, which typically they aren't. It's not the most comfortable. Your pillow, it's not that comfortable. How many of you make a big deal out of that? It's okay. Why is it okay? Why is it okay to be a little bit uncomfortable in a hotel room? Because you know that you're staying there for a short time and then you're leaving. There is a natural sense of detachment when you are a traveler. Because you're like, it's okay, I can handle it for a few days. It's not, the big, it's not that big of a deal, I'm leaving. Now, how does this apply to this life? The Prophet ﷺ is advising us to have that mindset in this life. That I'm only in this place for a short time and then I'm leaving. Just like you don't get attached to your hotel bed and your hotel chair and you don't start spending lots of money furnishing it, we should have that same mindset in this life. It does not mean that we can't have nice things. It does not mean that we can't furnish those, you know, rooms that we have or, or that we have things which are um, comfort. However, there is a big difference between having things that you own and letting those things own you.